glad to have you guys over here and uh, have your opinion of what I'll be doing. So today we're just gonna do like a, just a little sketch or something. So without wasting time, uh, I'm just gonna start with the... All right, guys. Uh, <laughs> mm, test. Oh shit. All right. Okay. Yeah, guys. That was just one thing. I was just wanna say. Yeah. Thanks so much for tuning. I, I guess. Uh, okay. Guys, thanks again for tuning in. This is Clovis AP, and uh, I'm an artist and entrepreneur. So you guys have been uh, following me on my Instagram, uh, yes, some of you. And for those of you who didn't follow me on Instagram, who have not yet followed me on Instagram, uh, let me just, this is a quick reminder of what I did on Instagram. I was just posting a lot of photos of my art and then I got like an idea, it was like, okay, I'm just gonna maybe also start with posting on my YouTube some videos, so ask people, uh, how many of you guys would like to see my art videos? And yeah, I just got a good feedback. Like most of them reply with uh, some, some amazing stuff. Like that was really cool. And it was really amazing to get uh, people with saying yes. You know, it was really great. And uh, today I'm just gonna show you some of the great things that uh, I've been doing. <laughs> uh, great thing, okay. so. As you can see here so this is gonna be almost like a sketch that I did and uh, I'm just gonna walk you through the steps on how I did it and if you guys like the video just click on the like button and also the subscribe and don't forget to click on the bell button for you not to uh, miss any future updates you know I'll be glad to have you in the farm walk up to the farm and yeah that will be really amazing so, with, uh, without wasting time, guys, I'm just going to head uh, to you and uh, head to my skate park and start drawing now. So, let's get it started. You ready for All right, uh, we're just going to start drawing some, uh, like a portrait of a person, a sketch, actually. And this one, we're going to be using Doodoo Custom uh, Sketch Park. Uh, you can get one of these anywhere so we'll be drawing uh, like someone I've never seen the person before and I uh, hope you've never seen him too or her I don't know what I'm gonna be drawing so let's just jump into it and just make some shapes here and the shapes they're gonna be like uh, our base uh, form uh, foundation what I mean and uh, it doesn't really have to be perfect from the start because the goal here is to draw from start to finish without using a eraser or rubber uh, depending on how you call it so we're just gonna go with some of the uh, base shapes and uh, we'll correct anything that's uh, wrongly pulled afterwards as, as we proceed so I'm just gonna be drawing the lines and everywhere you see yeah and after checking all the time that I, if I'm still getting a good shape if uh, all my lines are well pulled or if my my features are good and anything so from this one we can see we can, like this one can ever be female or male but depending on the, what I'm trying to do here it's gonna be a male uh, I hope that you'll be able to see. Now I'm gonna correct the ear here and then from there you're gonna see how I play with that. Yeah, yeah you have to be creative. And uh, after I'm gonna put the eyebrows and try to maybe switch the pencils, get some fine lines to help me go through it and uh, help me uh, lay down my foundation. And the where you draw it also you just be able to put some uh, some of the features like now I'm putting the eyes and make the person like uh, like have a look and try to correct some parts that are uh, wrongly pulled for me to have like a shape and, uh, and a proportion like 
as I said earlier, I'm not using any uh, reference photo, so it's just all come from my head. And yeah, it's, it's a good exercise actually, you know, like I really like this one and the way it's coming up, you know, yeah, you're just gonna be putting some of the stuff there. And then after when you try to see like you're gonna build the values and stuff, and uh, I'm gonna have like a paper so that I don't mess up with my drawing, you know, and also my hand needs to be clean. So when we're drawing, I'm just gonna make this person look at us. Oh, voila! <laughs> voila, yeah, the person is now looking at us. Wow, it's a young boy here, but uh, yeah, you can just make him an old man or young man, or depending on how you prefer and uh, anything, we're just going down from there. So I'm just gonna build it, uh, build it up and uh, try to make sure that the lines are really aligned with the proportions. And uh, from there we can just go, yeah you see it's starting to look like a person. Uh, if, have you ever seen this person before me? I uh, haven't seen this person. Uh, I don't know about you, but uh, if you've seen this person, just <laughs> tag him in a comment so that he knows. And if not, just give a name of this new person or new character that we're trying to create. Uh, give him a name or anything that will, <laughs> will come to your head. Uh, so let's see here, we're just building up everything and trying to make sure that we're trying to make uh, the person uh, look more realistic. So I'm just gonna go with some of the neck here and make him like wear a t-shirt. So as you can see, it's starting to look like someone. Starting from scratch, we didn't know what we we're doing. And up to now, still don't know where I'm doing, but yeah, I'm getting somewhere. <laughs> uh, yeah, so we go, this is my little uh, like light source. So, and then I'm gonna put in some shadows and that will help me also like uh, uh, build values and also uh, differentiate from uh, shadow shadows and light you know uh, trying to to make the person look more realistic and come out come out of the, the paper as I can say oh like uh, let's say 3d mode you see now it's coming out a bit so because the paper you know as you know the paper is in 2d uh, 2d which is a uh, uh, like a, a shape, a form of shape, like which is flat, and uh, 3D has to be with uh, like space. You need to see all the uh, dimension. You know, like it's three dimension and two dimension starting depending on how you, you per uh, perceive it. So this is the shadows and stuff that I'm trying to create with this person, and uh, yeah, starting to look good. <laughs> Oh man, just uh, have you found the name for him? Just put it down in the description. I'll appreciate that. And uh, just in case, I just want to remind you that you can also subscribe to my YouTube channel, Call This AP The Artist, and uh, share, comment, tag people, and leave uh, any question that you have. You can just leave in the comments, and I'll just re come back and reply to all your comments. I appreciate it. And uh, also the person who will get the good name or just a name that uh, that will sound great. We can, I can just shout shout the person out uh, in my next video. So I'm trying to give him a beard uh, because I have a beard. <laughs> oh my god! Oh shit! Sure. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm doing here. So I'm just trying to make like a beard uh, guy. So he's looking a bit old. I didn't like some of the features. The hair also, like you can see, I'm just like going, you know, not really that perfect, but we're getting somewhere because the, the base uh, thing here and the goal here is just to draw something uh, to build the foundation first, and then after you can just go from there and uh, build up, add more details for you to get the, the person uh, or the shape or anything that you're looking uh, for. So I'm just gonna add again some shapes here, make the, the hair a bit darker. And yeah, person is really, really, really great. And then from the shadows here, you can just go from the darker shadows to the lighter ones. And that will help you like uh, 
trying to build the values. So the lips are gonna be going like that. So let me just, I can add some, some beard over here too. Yeah, like make him like a real old man. Uh, yep. Oh my, okay, have you found a name for him? Just let me know, you know, like this person is really dope. I really appreciate the way he turns out. Oh my God. Yeah, like if you're here from the start and then we, you just see this, uh, you know, that means you guys, you don't have to give up guys. You know, some, some of you, some of the people just throw some and then they, uh, whenever it doesn't go away the way they want or oh, the shape is getting like a, a little bit not in their like code. Uh, uh, let me see here. Uh, you, and then the person would just, oh, normally yeah, the person would just try and uh, scrap the paper and put it in the bin, you know, in the trash and anything. So the person doesn't have to, to give up because you can build from like on top of everything and then you don't have, you see here, I don't even need an eraser. I don't even need to erase anything. I'm just building up gradually like on top of any. So, so many layers that you have here and that will help you also form something. And uh, later you can just decide if you're gonna frame it, if you're gonna uh, put it on a bigger, uh, bigger board or a canvas for you to paint it or anything. So that, all those stuff will come after, but right now I'm just drawing a letter sketch out for the sake of it, you know. <laughs> I'm really happy, I'm really enjoying this. I uh, hope you do. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe again. And uh, also follow me on Instagram, Clovis underscore AP. And uh, I'm gonna also put this video on my Patreon because this one is kind of speed. I'm gonna put the one with details where I explain every part or what I'm doing slowly, not in speed motion. So if you'd like to check it out, just go to patreon.com forward slash Clovis AP. Uh, that's in one word and uh, yeah you can join one of the tiers there and uh, I'll be glad to welcome you to the fam thank you it's been great and uh, I appreciate that peace thank you so much again for tuning in uh, this is Clovis AP an artist and entrepreneur okay I'm gonna be posting more videos on this channel so uh, start by subscribing to this uh, channel like you can click on the link somewhere here or down in the description and i'll be glad to have you over here so this is the me the king wrecking goma gear that's my shirt i'll be putting all the links in the bio <laughs> hey wrecking goma gear this is my shirt i'll be putting all the links uh in the description and that would be great too i'll be i'll be glad to have you guys over here and uh have your opinion of what i'll be doing